Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Guess where I am again because of you. I am at Burger King to do the quad stalker. So it is like less than 24 hours later. Hi, can I please have the quad stacker meal, please? Uh, Coke, please. Uh, that would be it. Thank you very much. All righty. So eight eighty for the quad stacker. It was eight dollars yesterday for just the chicken sandwich, uh, like the same meal, but this is a chicken sandwich. Interesting, hey? And the drive-through seems to be cleared out today. Uh, visa. That's Thank everything. You, Thank you. Have a great day. You too. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are parked. Let's do a quick drive-through test. Straw. Drink. This is kind of a review, but a challenge at the same time. Napkins. That was the bill, by the way. Let's see if the fries are just... Fries two days in a row, ladies and gentlemen. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Check it out, guys. They are crazy hot. I could feel it through the cardboard. Smell that. <laughs> Somebody said yesterday that the uh, option was, wasn't working. And I said they needed to upgrade their computer to the scratch and sniff Ken Domic version. Mm. So, we got 522 likes in just around 14 hours, which is amazing, by the way. I noticed when I went in, they have a bacon poutine or poutine. So if you want to see me come back and do that, we need some thumbs up. I'll try and figure out in a couple minutes what I need for that. I, I, if, if I get another 500 thumbs up, I'll come back and do the poutine. Uh, but I won't do it for a few days because I'm thinking about doing something else that I think you guys want me to do because I get requested to do this all the time and I can't believe I'm actually going to say this on my video. But I'm going to go over to McDonald's and do one of their secret item menus that you guys have been asking me for a while now. It is called, and I can't believe I have to say this, the McGangbang. So, if you want to see me do the McGangbang, I need 700 thumbs up on this video to go and do the McGangbang. I will have to do it Wednesday of next week. Um, so let's get into this thing. So thank you very much guys for that. 700, I'm thanking you in advance. So this is a quad stacker. It is much smaller than the quad whopper. A lot of people thought I had already done this, but the quad whopper Patties on a Whopper are like this big, and this is a lot smaller. This has no veggies on it, whereas the Whopper has your pickles, tomatoes, lettuce, and this is just meat, cheese, meat, cheese, meat, cheese, bacon, and that's it. But it's a lot smaller. It's going to be definitely easier to eat than the Quad Whopper. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. There is the Quad Stacker. Like I said, if I this is probably half the weight of the quad whopper. So this isn't really a challenge as opposed to it just being awesomely tasting amazing. So here we go again. This is what it looks like in real life. And this is what it looks like from the internet. Ding! I have food on my knuckle. So it is smelling amazing. Oh, I don't think they put anything else on it. It's just, oh, they might put like a mayo or something on there. Please, if you work for uh, D uh, Burger King, to let me know what, what sauce you put on here. But it looks like three pieces of bacon, four patties, four cheese. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We are going in 
for the quad stacker. Finally, I'm gonna have to change the the thumbnail on my quad whopper because I accidentally put the quad stacker on that thumbnail. So I'll change that just for you and you because you asked. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is really good. Wow. If you are a growing teenager and you are very hungry, I suggest the quad stacker. It, I, it's all over my hands, guys. This is disgusting. But tastes great. Wow. Like I said, if you are starving and you want something amazing to eat and it's a lot of food, this is perfect. The quad, Like I said, the quad uh, Whopper is just way too big, but this tastes amazing with the bacon and whatever sauce they put on this thing. Look at that. It's just meat and cheese. Ooh, bun. The bun's soft. Mmm. must be the uh, the Burger King special sauce. I'm sure somebody from Burger King is going to tell me the ex exact w sauce they use. Oh, it's a Thousand Island mixed with this. Or that. I'm going to have a couple more fries just in front of you to make you starving. Especially you, you people that watch this at 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm crazy. One of my favorite comments was, if you don't eat before you watch my video is a rookie mistake. Or eat while you're watching the video is a good idea, maybe. Okay, guys. You know what? I'm going to rate this before I get into the fast-paced part. This is a must-try. If you, again, are a teenager and you are starving because it's 3 o'clock in the morning... I suggest you grab a stacker, quad. The triple would be just as good. Probably save you a little bit of money. And it would taste exactly the same. All right, guys. So, like I said, on my on my rating scale, it is a go out and get it now. You got it? You got it? Here we go. We're going to eat this all up, and we got to get out of here, all right? Let's go. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was the Quad Stacker, not to be confused with the Quad Whopper. This was about half the size, I bet. Uh, definitely half the weight. Excuse me just a second. Uh. That's how good it was. So don't forget, guys, next time you're out at Burger King, try the Quad Stacker. You could probably do the, the, the Triple Stacker. It would be just as good and a little bit cheaper. I am... Full at the right amount, I was going to say size, right amount of food for me. I still have half my fries to eat. I usually eat them for about another half hour as I go down the road, back to home to edit this for you guys. So like I said, well, let's rate, like, quickly rate it again. This is a go out and get it now. The quad stacker, probably the, tri the, the single stacker, the double, the, the triple. All those stackers are really, really good. Uh, they, again, they all probably taste exactly the same. So thank you very much for watching this, guys. Uh, don't forget to thumbs up this video. Ding, 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 ding. Because we need to come back and do two things. I need to do the McGang Bang next week. And I'll do the the poutine with, with uh, the, well, the, the Burger King poutine with bacon in it sometime next week. I'm not sure exactly. I'm not, let's try Monday. If I get 500 thumbs up on this by Monday, which should be fine. This is... This should be going up Friday because I can't, I don't have time to do it tonight. So anyway, thank you very much, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, rate, and we will talk to you next time on Ken Dominic's Food Review. Ken out. Boop. Like this is going to be in the video. Me driving around the parking lot. 
and then somebody's coming through sideways. Nice. Let's see what happens if I park right there. Oh, this is gonna be perfect. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is it. I don't need no napkins. I'm crazy.